Ladies and gentlemen, it's Hollowtide here, and does the day end in why it does, which also means that Halo fans are a little upset right now, and I think that it's a little bit warranted. So if you haven't been on Twitter or you've been hiding under a rock for the past few days or week, you've seen that the new Fallout TV show has come out. And while I have seen people that are like still upset with the show and uh, for a lot of reasons and some kind of the same as what's with the uh, Halo TV show in terms of like the retcon, different timeline, all that, I don't know. It's kind of hard with Fallout because like there's the game's lore, which is canon, and I guess the show is also canon, but there are like things that have happened in the show that don't necessarily line up with choices that people make in the games and stuff, so... Well, I don't know. But, all in all, a lot of people have really enjoyed the Fallout TV show as, you know, compared to Halo's show, uh, which is very mixed. So, if we use something like, I don't know, Rotten Tomatoes, which is not the end-all be-all of, uh, you know, what people like, there's the audience score, there's the, you know, critic score and stuff, so, season two, we won't talk about season one of the Halo show, uh, I really feel like season two is where it really starts, and season two did a lot better, with a critic score of 90%, but an audience score of 69, nice. Keep in mind that the Halo show is also on Paramount, but that was a pretty big, uh, improvement over season one. As opposed to the first season of the Fallout show, 94% from the critics, which is close to 90 with Halo, but an 88% audience score. Pain. Also, the Fallout show is on Amazon Prime Video, which I also think is maybe a reason that it's kind of successful. Also, the actors, there's probably a couple more well-known actors that are in the Fallout show, but... Honestly, this has really, you know, got people talking about, oh, what could have been? Why is Halo on Paramount and stuff like that? I get it. Personally, I hope and pray that season three, you know, they're on the ring. They're, like, doing some Halo stuff. Like, the flood is going to be legit. I feel like season two was definitely an improvement on season one. And if season three is an improvement on season two, then we're really going to be eating good. I mean... My my bar is kind of low, I guess, but, like, if the average audience score for the Halo show, like, with Halo fans is, like, 75% to 80%, I think we're eating good at that point. But it just thinks that it took, like, three seasons for us to get there. Also, while we're talking about TV shows and, like, video games and stuff like that, X-Men 97 is fantastic. If you have not watched that show on Disney, man, they really, as an old head, you know, I... <laughs> I am very happy with how well that show is. I think it's like got a, it's over 90% on both the audience and critic scores and almost 100% on the, the critic side of things. So pretty lit. Go watch that show. But again, you know, we've talked about it before, the fumbling the ball of like the Halo media outside of like the books and the games. Um, man, we, we could have had a great movie with uh, the District 9, I guess, pivot way back in the day and... We had all those amazing live-action trailers, and it's just, we're going to get there. I personally want an animated Halo show. Uh, that might be a hot take, but I feel like you can do things in an animated space and still be, you know, like, adult-friendly, you know, like it's like a grown-up show. I think of things like cyberpunk and, I don't know, any anime, really. But beggars can't be choosers. Let me know in the comments down below if you've watched the Fallout show, how you feel about the Fallout show, how you feel about it compared to the Halo show, and if you think Season 3 will get above here. We're going to do... This video is sponsored by Sports Gambling Betting Halo Infinite Challenge Impossible.com. Do you think Season 3 of the Halo TV show will be over or under... 75% for the audience score. Make sure you, you bookmark this video, like this video, and like a year when it comes out, we'll come back to it. And uh, yeah, I think 76%, so I'm going with the over. But that's going to do it for the video, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. We're trying to hit 15K. I would love that. 
I also stream on Twitch. You should follow that. It's in the description. I also tweet on Twitter. I'm pretty lit on there. That's what the kids say, I think. Anyways, I'll see you guys around the ring. Peace!